Hey, this is Jack Skullboys. Watching the replay of the Cowboys uh, win 27 to 24 over the San Francisco 49ers. It's a long week of uh, a lot of people criticizing Romo, uh, especially the people who are against them, such as uh, Warren Sapp and Marshall Falk and them kind of guys. Uh, very critical of him. And uh, a lot of Cowboys fans have been um, complaining about Romo. Um, and this week he just proved them all wrong and um, proved that he's uh, his toughness and uh, what kind of uh, great quarterback he can be in the clutch. He's the clutch quarterback that they always needed since Aikman. So we're watching the replay now. And uh, Austin is about to make a, a touchdown to tie up the game. This is just a power rush by a big man, Ray McDonald. This is man up from heaven for a defensive coordinator. When you can get an inside pass rush like that, and Ray McDonald is showing that he did last year or last week, that inside pass rush is the thing. As you can see, uh, Romo is getting hit pretty much and uh, showing his toughness. He had uh, a fractured rib and uh, also a uh, punctured or lung. Pump, uh, punctured lung so playing through that was very hard he was missing a lot of passes and um, but uh, he wouldn't stay on the sidelines he would not stay on the sidelines uh, getting us through about two interceptions and uh, just did not want to after last year's long season he did not want to Go down to that zero and two, which would be a hard deficit to go down to. Touchdown is upcoming.
There it is, tied up. drive that saved the day. Um, Romo to Austin. Austin had an incredible game. 143 yards. Uh, he's injured. He was injured also. I, I'm not sure what it was, but he's going to be out next week. Des Bryant could possibly be back. Um, Austin will be back. Austin will be back in a couple weeks, I guess. He'll be out for a couple weeks. But uh, he showed his toughness. Uh, Witten also had uh, rib fractures, but he'll, he plays through anything, Witten does, so he'll be back next week also. A uh, good thing to note is uh, after two games, uh, R Tony Romo is uh, fifth in passing. Um, I think Brady's number one, and uh, Philip Rivers is three. And I can't remember who else is in there, but Marcus Ware has the most sacks at four sacks. And Sean Lee has uh, the most uh, tackles in the league, league-wide. So looks like Newman might be back next week. Looks like he is going to be back. So they signed a new, new receiver, Robinson, and got rid of McCann. Walker will be playing. Uh, he played last week. Sounds like he did good. And uh, another big story was uh, Jesse Hawley making that big touchdown. And not the touchdown, but uh, the game saver when uh, Austin was out at the end of the game. Uh, he ran for which should have been a touchdown, it looked like, but they called it down at the one. And uh, Dan Bailey made the winning uh field goal in uh, overtime which he missed earlier a short one but he made up for it uh, had a 48 yarder right at the end of this game where it uh, where that uh, put it into overtime so Dan Bailey looks like a good kicker and uh, the defense of Dallas is they got I think it was six sacks in this game so they should be leading we should be leading the, the league in sacks down now pretty soon. So, so Romo uh, kind of showed what he's made of and um, shows all of the Romo haters and the people that are against Romo, even the Cowboys fans who complain about him, that uh, Romo is the real deal. And uh, coming out on a game like that and bringing him back to win was something we really needed. Um, I know it got my hopes up for the season now. Um, next week we play the, the Redskins and hopefully Romo will be back and don't look like Miles will be there but maybe Des Bryant. Um, 
But there's a good lineup of uh, receivers we also have. You know, Ritt Witten's going to play through anything. And it sounds like Felix Jones is going to be back. So. so, And also we got Newman back on the other side. And um, they're showing the defense right now. Um, so I'd say go Cowboys. Uh, win them Redskins. Get on top of the division with the 2-1. and one. Next weekend at, at Cowboy Stadium.